and uh, welcome to Sri Lanka's number one sports hub, thepopray.com. We are live from the Sukhudasa swimming pool complex for the second leg of the 28th annual Dr. R. L. Heyman Trophy water polo encounter between uh, Royal College and uh, St. Thomas's College. Akta Jaffa, 19 years old, senior colorsman on the left bar. Royal will, um, Saint, I beg your pardon, St. Thomas will look to mark him. Omira Lokoge, the man of the hour. 18 year old, right bar, strongly built, fast swimmer, excellent water polo player. Mishan Kotiarachi on the left wing. It's uh, Manuel Vikram Ratna for St. Thomas's, the skipper playing at uh, bar. It will be crucial for St. Thomas's uh, vice captain Randeep David at uh, wing. Gehan Vijay Singer, another one of the experienced players uh, for St. Thomas's. Twenty-eighth annual Dr. R. L. Heyman Trophy water polo encounter. There will be a lot of nerves uh, from both the sides. They know they're close, and we have start off swim ball on. Omira Lokoge looks to get to the ball first, unless St. Thomas's can come up with something. Well done by Omira Lokoge. Brilliant technique to win that swim ball, and we have Akil Firoz at centre position looking to distribute. They'll need one of the wingers here. Akta Jaffa looking for Akin Mohanan Patrin on that right wing. He's free. Samantha Disanayaka takes up a bar position. Will he take the five meter shot and go for it? Oh, brilliant shot. Good effort. Akta Jaffa free on the right. Omira can just swim this one. He, he's all alone. He's got clear water in front of him. Looks for Akta Jaffa. Right bar free. Akin Mohanan Patrin goes in, goes in, fakes, takes the shot. Very well stopped by the goalkeeper. Domian. Exclusion, so Royal on extra man again. Akin Mohanan Patrin on that uh, right bar. Looks for Omira Lokogi on the left bar. Royal going into double prop. Yamit Jayakuri as well in the center pocket. Omira should make this count. He does! Beautifully done by Omira Lokogi. The first score of the match goes to Royal College. So, oh, just loses the ball. St. Thomas does actually have, uh, um, because having the Disanak is on the other side of the pool, St. Thomas does only have five attackers on the side. So. Left-hander coming in there, Sai Saivendra takes a beautiful shot, oh, ricocheted, and well done by St. Thomas's College. Very... Akil Fairoz on the centre, distributes Omir Lokoge, looking for Saivendra Disanayaka in the centre pocket, he's free, he's free and he scores! Well done by Saivendra Disanayaka. Anam swims up, this is dangerous, they can't let the Tomin shooters come into that 5 meter mark, Omanla. Omanla takes it, beautifully done, Barnako Virasinghe needs to bring his game up here. As we have an exclusion again, Akta Jaffa puts it in the back of the net. Well done there by the senior colorsman. The Hanaika doesn't seem to be doing much. Diresh David has clear water in front of him. He wants to go. Akin Mohanan Patrin takes the lob, takes the lob. Oh, unfortunate. Outstanding water polo players in the pool and a very close game. So the first quarter goes to Royal College. Three goals to two. Set the next quarter. He'll be telling his boys probably. Let's just repeat the first quarter that Royal did. Take it from there and take this game into the last quarter like a Mahindra Singh Dhoni esque on it. Akil Fairoz, good start, but I think Diren David has a little bit on him. Looks close to call from here. Akil Fairoz just gets there. Well done. Royal College, two out of two. This is good. His hands, Omir takes the shot, takes the shot. Very well. Just needs to tap the ball out of his hand without getting onto his back. No goal, no goal. Banu Kabir Singh did, did well there. He had both angles free. Akta Jaffa. Unnecessary backhand there from long range. St. Thomas says, with a chance to score. Falls right in front. Oh no, Royal College are very, very lackadaisical in front of that goal on rebound. Savindri Sanayaka in the middle of the pool turns. He, if he lets go, it'll be a sure penalty. Oh no. Made a right mess of that one. Savindri Sanayaka. Very well done. That was a sure Royal goal. So Royal have missed two to three opportunities where they could have been. Mishan Kotiarachi can take the lob shot if he needs. Go in, look for Akta Jaffa in the center pocket. Oh no, Akta take the shot they say, take the shot they say. And he does it beautifully done there by Akta Jaffa. As we have Samandir Desanayaka struggling on goal and he's got an exclusion. He just needs to take the shot. Oh no, what is Samandir Desanayaka doing? He could have 
pass to another up on the five meter tired looking shot it was New Orleans and Thomas's boat there's a lot riding on this a lot at stake here these boys have trained for the best part of 10 11 sometimes 12 months for this day but uh, given that how uh, Sanjay Disanayak the skipper has missed quite a few opportunities and uh, Savir Vijay Singh with his goalkeeping they will be they will be slightly concerned the Jaffa Akifai was free in the pocket wow it's gone defenders hands up they say good save by Barnaka Vijay Singh how the Beautifully done by Omer Loko game. Confident, sure of his shot. Well intercepted by Royal College. Savinder Disanayaka read that pass. Beautifully done. Very good defense by Omer Loko game. Showing both hands there. Very well taken. Lob. Very well taken goal there by Manurav Vikramaratna. Got into the position that he needed to be in. Manurav showing Omer Loko game that uh, St. Thomas has got the skills to back up this Heyman. Omer Loko game with the shot. Corner ball coming up. The two bars or the left wing will look to shoot. Royal College know it. Then Dias comes up on that wing. Akindo Handun Patirana. Unlucky. Unlucky by Akil Zuhair. 5 4. It stands. And it's 19 15 on aggregate. Royal leading. Akindo Handun Patirana. Oh, beautifully saved. Beautifully saved. Asking for the ball. Oh, beautifully done. That's why he asks for the ball. And that's why he is so feared on that top three shooting trio that Royal College have managed to put together this year. They make it count as they high-five each other. Akta Jaffa looks to be taking this second leg away from St. Thomas's little by little. St. Thomas is in a double prop position. Beautiful ball into the prop there. Exclusion coming. Man in the center is free. Well, good switch up there by Akta Jaffa. Royal look to bounce the goal now. Manuel Vikram Singh. Vikram Ratna needs to make this count. Gets in quite close. Unlucky. Good defense by Royal College. But Sai Savindra has been doing a brilliant job at defending this um, water polo powerhouse in Savindra Disanayaka. Nidhali Luk Pitya coming into the bar. Wow, what a shot from Savindra Disanayaka. Omir Lokoge, the star shooter for Royal College, sets this one up, bounces it. Wow, unlucky. Brought in for all college, coming back from four goals. Beautifully done there by Savinder Disanayaka. This man is a class act. Royal seem to be running away in this quarter. Seven goals to four, three goals advantage. Again, coach Bilal Hassan puts his bench in. Prob of 21-15 uh, in favor of Royal. Make it 21-16. Uh, Wonderful goal. Wonderful goal there by Manula Vikramaratna. The captain shows exactly why he's been given responsibilities of leadership. Not just the talent, but the, the cool head that he has on him, which uh, him to shoot. Crowd wants another goal from this uh, Thomian team. Gyan Vijasingha does it. Does it in style. Beautifully done. Gyan Ratna Tunga, the more inexperienced centre marker. Royal, five seconds away from Heyman Glory. As they do it, very well done there by Royal College. Bilal Hassan, Isibarno de Silva and Harshaka Nisanga, the coaching staff, to everyone who helped out with this team in the last four to five years. You've done an amazing job with these set of boys and they've won the second leg. Seven goals to six, close game by uh, both teams, but Heyman victory for Royal College once more. Amazing scenes at the Sugadasa swimming pool complex. As the crowd joins in to say that what Polo made, the, made us the men that we are today. Yes, indeed. Uh, Royal winning it back-to-back, uh, -back, the 28th Dr. R.L. Heyman trophy encounter. It's indeed a pleasure to be witnessing these games. It's a privilege for the boys to represent their colleges. And I hope um, everyone watching at home and on their computers in different parts of the world will enjoy the production that uh, the papare.com has provided us with then manula vikramaratna vice captain randeep david and in cap order subish kahennayaka anam sauja komin karuna sekara akil zuhair sai sivendra diren dias shivan ebaneza gehan vijay singh Sharia Kurukula Surya, Diresh David, and Saviru Vijay Singha.
to the champions, Royal College. Captain Savinda Disanayaka, Vice Captain Akindu Handun Patirana, and the players in cap order. Banuka Veera Singha, Nithila Ilukpitiya, Mishan Kote Arachi, Umidu Katugampola, Keshara Gunasekara, Yamit Jayakodi, Yehan Ranatunga, Akta Jaffa, Dulwin Dahanayaka, Omira Lokuge, Akil Fairoz and Tisal Gamage. The most valuable player is awarded for the best all-round performance across the two legs. The most valuable player for the, for the year 2019. Do we have any guesses? You got it right. It's none other than cap number seven of Royal College, Akta Jaffa. The most valuable player, Akta, is brought onto stage by his captain. Let me also recognize Akta Jaffa has scored a total of seven goals throughout the two legs. Ladies and gentlemen, after two weeks of exciting water polo games, after the first leg of a royal victory of 14 goals to 11, and the second leg royal victory of seven goals to six, with the aggregate of 21 goals to 17 for the second year running the champions of the 28th Dr. R. L. Heyman Trophy presenting Royal College.